Hi, my name is Marvin Close, and for the last 15 years uh, I've been a professional writer, mainly in television and theatre. Um, among the credits that you've probably heard of are uh, Coronation Street, I worked on the story team there. Uh, I wrote about 70-odd episodes of Emmerdale. Uh, I've written uh, for children's hits like uh, The Story of Tracy Beaker and 24-7, uh, and I'm currently writing a, a film for Channel 4. Um, I went to university in Lancaster and I studied English and educational studies. And I guess the reason that I wanted to do English was I'd always harboured great hopes to become a writer. And I kind of felt that going to university uh, to do English would, would help me. It certainly did in quite a number of ways. Uh, I think the main one was that it taught me about other writers. Um, I think as a, a writer myself, it's really important to read as widely as possible to try and work out in quite some detail uh, how the writers piece together their work, uh, how they draw their characters, how they develop their stories. And I learned a great deal of that from uh, the analysis of works that I did at university in English. From there, I left, of course, and uh, it took quite a while to go full-time as a, a writer because if you want to become a professional writer after leaving university, you will find it's hard work. There are a lot of people out there like you who want to be doing the same job. So what I would suggest um, is that beyond the dreams you may have with your own writing, one thing you really need to do is learn a lot more about craft. Uh, about how to structure, about how to plot, about how to develop characters, all the craft skills that are so necessary for making TV and film and indeed for theatre. One of the places I would truly recommend to you is the Leeds Metropolitan University's MA in Film and Television Writing. Uh, it's a course that I've done some occasional tutoring on, and it's a very high standard of uh, tutoring generally on that course. Um, the advice I would also give you is go that extra mile, because there's going to be loads of people out there, as I say, who want to do the same work that you're doing. So you've got to make sure that you're always ahead of the bunch, so hard work and lots of hard work after that.